My first ever 3v3 games using 2K25 My Player builds. And 2K matched me up against Wavy Mello and Yo, that's EJ. And I was playing point guard for my team, so it was time to lock in. So drop a like for more 2K25 content and subscribe to the channel. We better hit this 900K. Make sure you're following the Twitch and let's get into the video. What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Henry, aka Double H, back at it with yet another early 2K25. And as you guys can see by the title, we are going to have some 3v3 My Core gameplay against EJ and Wavy be mellow but before we get into the teams the specifics and the gameplay this is the build i was running in this specific game now just fyi i am not making this build i don't recommend making this build either i just made this build knowing that in the my core we had no animation so no dunk packages equipped no dribble moves equipped no jump shots equipped default everything and i don't even think we had badges either so knowing that i like just minimize my ball handle as much as i could and just max my speed of ball because i knew i wasn't gonna have any dribble moves anyways and then i kind of just upgraded some other stuff but yeah we had a 93 three-pointer 89 dunk 85 perimeter 79 steel those are kind of the main attributes that you're kind of want to, I guess, know while watching the gameplay. And yeah, this build came out to be a two-way, three-level scoring threat. Once again, don't make that build. It's just not a good build. Uh, but yeah, I just made it based off knowing that we were going to get all the default stuff going into, you know, this MyCore gameplay. But yeah, I went into the MyCore, you know, got some jumpers up with the default jump shot. But these are the teams for this specific 3v3 game that i'm showing in today's video so the teams were wavy mellow who was on some kind of like iso build and then ej who was on a center build that could shoot the ball and then they had a third who was on like another iso build like wavy mellow i don't remember who exactly was their third though and then they were taking on me at point guard on that build you just saw solo on lockdown and then hollywood on a center build that only had a mid-range upgraded but yeah drop a like subscribe to the channel and let's get into the gameplay all right we are getting into this my court gameplay so as you can see we all ended up joining each other's my courts now i don't know if you're gonna be able to do this to test builds in the actual game like with friends but that would be cool but anyways we set up the 3v3 now i know everyone's my players are just exactly the same look exactly the same and the gamer tags are like crazy because this was obviously at community day but i'll try my best to point out who is who throughout the games it's gonna be pretty obvious who's who on our team because obviously uh, this is my gameplay it's my pov so you're gonna obviously know who the user is in this gameplay but yeah we're taking on ej we're taking on wavy mellow i got hollywood on my team i got solo on my team we're on that 6-6 build and this is the first possession now you got to remember we have default everything and we don't know what settings we're on so keep that in mind so like i'm gonna be missing like open shots that i'm not gonna be missing in the final game but look at first thing i call out solo for a back door and wavy mellow he's already spamming that square button wait hold on mellow Ch chill brody chill on that square button for me brody but nah that, that was a good foul because we you know back door I was looking for Hollywood on the slip right here. EJ's the center that was guarding him right here, and he gets scored on. So already up to 2-0. Two, two oh, uh, I get an easy assist right there. Also, notice my takeover in the top right. Also, whoa, almost a bump steal right there. Yo, the bump steals are really OP in 2K25, by the way. But yeah, I don't think we had any badges in this gameplay either because no badges ever pop up in the top right. But we were purposely leaving EJ open. I'm not going to lie. Yo, EJ shoot a very early on the first shot. I mean, to be fair, he doesn't know what settings he's on. But I ain't gonna lie, EJ, we were, the game plan was before we started the game to leave you open, I ain't gonna lie. I call solo on the back door. That's another easy assist. I was just trying to get a, us some points on the board to get us a quick little lead. But also maybe getting some takeover in. You see, I'm guarding ball though. We just we just played man. Like I, even though solo's the lock, we're just like, screw it, we'll play man. Cause everyone looks exactly the same. So it's kind of confusing like who to guard and stuff. Once again, we're purposely leaving EJ open. Wide open right there. He shoots it slightly early. He saves it in though. So he gets a good dive animation but then they end up fouling us immediately so you know that's a good foul they fouled on the fast break we're up four to zero we really we haven't missed a shot yet i mean it's only two standing dunks but look at the drill moves i mean i just i'm just looking awkward but i dot solo in the corner and he greens it yo solo with the cash money three in the corner that's a dot so we got three assists already and we're up seven to zero already in this gameplay once again, EJ catches the ball at the top of the key, and he gets the easy driving dunk to go. And that is their first basket of the game. So now it's 7-2. to I'm bringing up the ball. Looking for a driving dunk. I easily easily could have got that, to be honest. But I was passing out to Hollywood to try to get him a little mid-range jumper, which, once again, I do right here. He does have a mid-range. He doesn't have a three-pointer. And that's green. So we're looking really good right now. We haven't missed a shot yet. We're up 9-2. to 
I'm like halfway to take over as well. We purposely leave EJ open, bro. He, that almost looked like an air ball. Another very early. I, I'm already knowing, yo, I don't know what Wavy Mel was saying during this game, but I already know they were, he was yelling at EJ probably. But anyways, nine to two right here. I'm running up the court. Once again, default drill moves. I try to do like a reverse dunk, but I get like this step back animation. I don't know really what I was going for there. But yeah, into the pick and roll. I mean, we have no drill moves. I try to get a three off. I accidentally fade and I end up missing. And once again, like there are no badges popping up. So I'm pretty sure we have no badges in this. So my first jump shot is a miss. Wavy Mellow tries to go up with the spin layup. That You ain't getting these spins in here, Wavy Mellow. This, this ain't 2K24. But we get the wide open dunk meter on the uh, fast breaker there. So now we're up 11 to two. So after Mello tried his patented spin move, they hit the back door and they end up getting an easy bucket right there. I'm not sure who that was that dunked that. I don't know if that was their third or if that was Mello, one of the two. Anyways, I could have hit Hollywood on the slip right there, end up hitting him on the pop, but he doesn't have a three pointer, so he doesn't want to shoot that. And we're just resetting. I only have two adrenaline here. And bro, I mean, the default drill moves are so bad. It's so awkward. But look at me getting to the rack with the easy dunk meter. Once again, no dunk packages equipped. And look at my takeover. I'm what is, what is that? Level three, maybe level four takeover right there. I think that's level. I think we're in level four. Level four takeover right now that we're purposely leaving EJ open again. And he shoots an early kill. That, leaving him over his feet and families right now. But anyways, we're up, we're up 13 to four. I'm really just at this point, I know we're going to win. So I'm just like, you know what? I want to just, I want to shoot a three. Like I want to just shoot some stuff, but like, it's so hard to get open with literally not a single move equipped, but Hollywood just backs down EJ, throws it up and gets it to go. And right now I have four points, one rebound, five assists. I missed the only three pointer I attempted and I'm almost at level five takeover, but yeah, they're struggling to score the ball. We're playing great defense, 15 to four. We leave EJ wide open again on purpose, bro. A very, that's his third very early. Yo what it was going on in this game ej we we got to know anyways they're low-key leaving hollywood i'm trying to just get something off because like we're up 11 so i'm trying to just do anything hollywood is probably thinking the same thing so he shoots like like oh it was open it looked like it was a questionable shot but it ends up being open but he misses that they're on the fast break ej gets the easy dunk and now it's 15 to 6. now once again we're still up nine and this is our first time testing like 2k25 so I'm just trying to do anything I could possibly do with these drill moves. I'm trying to get open for a three. So I just shoot some contested stuff just to do it. It was a tight, slightly early. I felt like that was timeable though. I feel like if I had badges with a jump shot equipped, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like that's green. That might be crazy to say, but like when I shot that, it felt like there was a, there was a good green window there. Anyways, 15 to eight after they get another dunk. I call Soul on the back door. It's not there, but they're playing good defense off of it. I end up shooting a fadeaway back fade three and green it for my first green three of 2K25 on a my player build. And look at my takeover, bro. Like I'm having a really good game. Like out of all the guards at Community Day, I don't know if I really saw anybody get this close to max like takeover ability. I'm on the fast break. I shoot a questionable shot. And yeah, that was a light pressure. End up losing a little take, I think, from that. But we're up 18 to 8. I'm, I'm testing stuff out. I don't know who shot there. I don't know if that was Wavy Mellow. He just shot a Sosa, a heavy. I get the wide open dunk on the fast break. And yeah, bro, I don't know if I have takeover ability at this point. I don't think I do. I think I'm barely off it. But look at my takeover. I mean, it is lit the heck up. That thing is burning hot. Nine points, one rebound, five assists with one missed three. Actually, do I? No, I have two missed threes because I shot that one on the fast break. Uh, I, Someone right there misses an open midi. That was either Mello or the other dude. I shoot a front fade three right here, miss again. So I'm kind of just chucking up, but I get the lane steal. So I get it back, W lane steal. It's 20 to eight game point. I'm just forcing it. I lost a lot of take from getting stripped right there. And by the way, that strip animation I've noticed, if you have like a 91 seal, you get that like almost every time if you're holding your right stick up um, as a defender. But anyways, 20 to eight, I'm trying to dot solo right there for the game winner, but they're guarding it. So it's whatever, but dude, these drills are so bad. These default drill moves like, I wish I could have put something on, but look at me getting the dunk meter over EJ. And we end up winning that game 22 to eight. And that is my first 3v3 my court, or I guess technically park game, even though we're not in the park with a my player build type of gameplay of 2K25. If y'all enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel, 900K on the way. Make sure to follow the Twitch. I will be grinding to Legend 5 this year. I will be grinding that ranked mode. I'll be grinding this game a lot this year, so I can't wait to play it. 
Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. It's been your boy Henry, aka Double H, and I'm out of here, y'all. Peace.